here and welcome back to another Pro Wrestling Crate unboxing. That's right guys, this is February 2017's theme is High Flyers. Oh yeah. So Pro Wrestling Crate, probably one of my favourite boxes I unbox on the channel every single month. So if you haven't already known that I unbox Loot Crate, Loot Gaming and also WWE Slam Crate which is a pretty awesome wrestling crate by Loot Crate as well. So I have February's Loot Gaming and the Slam Crate still to come for this month or like well, last month's February. So it should be here very soon. And then of course we did the Loot Crate already for February. Link for that is in the description down below guys. So as you can see I have another Pro Wrestling Crate over there. That's last month's one. I pretty much have all my goodies in there from like all the crates that I've unboxed by them. They're awesome. And of course, on top of them, up, like underneath the Sasha Banks thing, is a whole bunch of my WWE Ushis. My recent WWE Ushi video will be in the description down below, guys, as well as the NRL Traders video if you want to check that out. Links in the description down below. But guys, if you are enjoying these unboxings, not just these subscription crates, but toy unboxings, as well as like card unboxings and toy hauls and toy reviews, make sure you smash that like button hard, guys, but not too hard. Don't break your computers. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button and also tick the little bell so you can be notified as soon as I upload a video. So not only will you be a part of the dog squad, but you'll become a part of the notification dog squad. So let's get right into this right now. February's Pro Wrestling Crate. Oh yes, High Flyers. They did say that this was probably one of the best ones they've done to date. I believe um, next month's theme is Indie Wrestling, or Best of, in best of Indie Wrestling. So that should be very interesting to see and they said that that one's probably one of their all time favourite ones as well so very interested. Let's cut it open right now and I'm going to show you a little snook peek. Do I have to cut the side? Nope. Oh, just one cut and here we go. Time to show you a little sneak peek. I don't know if you'll be able to see too much of it but then I will feel around and try and... Okay, actually, scratch that, there is tape. I forgot that this one they tape up the top as well at the very middle area. Which is cool because it makes sure that your stuff stays in the box and nothing gets pulled out by the, you know, the posty man. He's like, ooh, wrestling crate, yummy, I want to take those goodies. Well, not today, Mr. Postman, not today, because I got my goodies right here. Here we go. I'm not sure if you can see too much of that, guys, but that's a little sneak peek. Now I'm going to feel around. Okay, so I believe that's the card on top like normal. I think it feels like a... Usually it's a hard piece of paper card, so I don't know what that is. I'm going to put that behind me. We'll have a look at that last. I feel the free t-shirts. I feel something plastic. I don't know what that is. It feels maybe like a poster type of card or something like that. What do we have? A hard piece of plastic. So we got a soft piece of plastic and a harder piece of plastic. We have the pin, which is awesome. As always, like I think last month's theme was uh, Latino Heat. And it was a Vicky Guerrero pin. Pretty cool. Uh, we got a bunch of like pieces of paper. Uh, there's probably other stuff under the t-shirt. So, oh, was that a figure? Maybe not. I don't know. So we're going to go with one of the t-shirts first. But if you do want to check out last month's one, which is January. The theme was Latino Heat. It's in the description down below, guys. But here we go. First shirt of this crate, it is... Okay, it's a purpley, um, dark blue type of shirt. What is it? Oh, yeah! We got the Macho Man Red Savage. Ooh, yeah. That's awesome. I like this purple design that they're doing. Damn, boys and girls. Damn. That's awesome. It's like a navy purple blue. And it says Macho Man Red Savage. Oh, yes. Great one, guys. This is a great one because, of course, he's a high flyer. So, rest in peace, Macho Man. But this is going to be a good shirt to wear down the street. Okay guys, so we're going to go with the pin next. What do we have? Ooh, it's the Hardy Boys. It's, I believe, yeah, it's a Jeff Hardy one. Or is it Matt? I believe it's one of the Hardy Boys. I'll get it at the end because I'm pretty sure this is the Hardy Boys. It's just that. It's the image right here, guys. I'm pretty sure it's the Hardy Boys, but here's the image right here, guys. It actually looks pretty cool. Epic pin by Pro Wrestling Crate. Like I said, this company... Like I said, this crate is probably one of my favourite, like, companies for unboxing and stuff, so I am so happy that, you know, I'm now unboxing them every single month. Hell, I might even go and get an affiliate program started up, guys, so you can all get a discount when you sign up using my code. So, I might actually look into that, but next thing, guys, what is it? Okay, we have, oh, yeah, boy! Guys, we have, from TNA, it is the Hardy Boys, Vanguard 1. Beta, powered by seven de uh, deities, Cameron, North Carolina. Oh yeah, 
Vanguard. Woo! Oh yeah, boy. We got that Vanguard. Delete! 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 Oh yeah. Okay, next thing. Ah, what's this? Feels fabricy. What is it? Ooh, what is this? Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Ah, oh, okay. So we have like a little flying thing that you can put on your wall. I guess it's meant to be attached to like. You could probably, yeah, you know. I know you could probably put like a, a stick in there or something and have, wave it around. But it's the Ricky the Dragon Steamboat winner. The greatest match of its time. Okay, cool. In the Silver Dome. Awesome. Okay, I think it's about time we unbox another t shirt. Right here, guys. What's it gonna be? Okay, it's a black one and it's got like a little bit of gold writing on it. So, what is it? Uh, oh, it's Matt Seidel. Awesome. That's epic, boys. Oh, yeah, I'll be walking down the street wearing the Seidel t shirt. Oh, yeah. Matt Seidel. I believe that's Evan Bourne, guys, if you don't already know. Um, good to see that he's out of jail right now. <laughs> don't hold that weed, boys and girls. Don't hold that weed. Not in Japan, or you go to jail. But yeah, so we got a Matt Seidel t-shirt. That is awesome. Funny story is I actually was wearing my Lince Dorado t-shirt that I got from Pro Wrestling Crate last month in the Latino Heat one. I wore it down the street, and people were just looking at it, like reading it like, I know what that is, but do I know what that is? Well, they're going to be looking at me wearing the Matt Seidel t-shirt right now. Oh yeah, this is awesome. Two epic shirts, Macho Man Randy Savage and Matt Seidel. What more could you ask for? You have to put Evan Bourne in there, because if you didn't, he's a high flyer and you've got to be in this box. Okay, the last t-shirt will be on the last thing, guys. Okay, here's the DVD. What is it? Okay, we have Freelance Wrestling Presents Musafa Ali from the WWE Cruiserweight Division on 205 Live. So how awesome is that we have Masafa Ali, the complete collection of his freelance wrestling. Oh, okay, so it's like him versing a bunch of people. Uh, see if I can... Uh, Marty Scroll, okay. DJ Z, that's awesome. Two matches that I know the people, but the other matches I'm not really sure. But I will definitely watch this. Oh yeah. Okay, next thing guys, what is it? What's this? Oh, hell yeah. This is awesome. <laughs> this is awesome! Literally, it says this is awesome and it is awesome, guys! It says this is awesome, clap, 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 clap. It's like you can have this in the, in the crowd. It doesn't say, it's just like a mad little merchandise thing of just a hand clapper. <laughs> Hell yeah, this is cool, guys. So, whenever I go to a WWE Live event now, when I'm going to one later on this year when I move to Newcastle, I'm going to go to the one live. I'll probably go to the NXT one as well. I'll take this and I'll be like, this is awesome. <laughs> oh yeah. Awesome stuff so far guys. Nothing has disappointed me in this crate. It never really does. Like last month's one was pretty damn awesome stuff also. There's a couple of things I wasn't too sure on, but after I looked it all up, I was enjoying it all. But uh, this is like the third time I've done Pro Wrestling Crate and it definitely won't be the last because it's probably one of my favorite ones to unbox every damn month. Okay guys, next thing. What do we have? It's a postcard. Oh, okay, who is this? It's written weirdly. I can't tell who this is. So, so it's a, you know, you've got the certificate of authenticity on there, but it's a postcard. Huh. It doesn't say who it is. Oh, here we go. On the, Yeah, it does say on the postcard. When Psychosis and Rey Mysterio Jr. waged war at the famed ECW arena, US wrestling fans were wowed by a high-flying style uh, they were not used to. These matches changed the game, and the photo was by George Thanos, or Thanos. Pretty damn cool. So, Rey Mysterio Jr. and Psychosis. Damn, like, oh, see? Some of this stuff surprises me, like the hand clapper, the Vanguard 1 like, Frisbee. Definitely taking that on the beach. Be like, Vanguard, go and get them! Delete them all! But definitely awesome. This crate, I can see why they said it's probably one of the best ones to date that they've ever done. I can't wait for the best of the indie wrestling one that they're doing either. Because this stuff is just insane. Okay, what else do we have? We have the t-shirt. Oh, what's that? So we have our signature and then we have something else. I can't remember. Is this a poster maybe? I don't know. What is this? And it's a poster. Match of the year 2016. Oh, 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 what do we have here, ladies and gentlemen? It is 
Ricochet and Will Ospreay. Hell yes. How awesome, guys. It's a poster that can go up on the wall. So match of the year, 2016. We have Ricochet. So we have Ricochet and Will Ospreay. We have them in a Block B, New Japan Wrestling Best of the Super Junior. Oh yeah. So guys, how awesome is that? Ricochet and Will Ospreay. So damn, that is actually awesome. I might hang that up in my new office room when I get it set up. Same with the Shinsuke Nakamura poster that I got in the Slam Crate. Like, I think it was the first ever one. So that would definitely go up. And same with that one, because that looks pretty cool. Will Ospreay and Ricochet, pretty cool. Okay guys, here we go. Autograph comes in this little thing, as you could already know. Who is it gonna be? Oh, here we go. Oh yeah, guys. R. V. D. Oh yeah. We got the RVD signed autograph. Hell yes. That is pretty cool. And it's got the five star from Splash that he always does. Like he signed five star and then RVD. That's pretty cool. Rob. Bam. Damn. One of a kind. Okay, guys. Last thing in the box. It's the t shirt. Who's it gonna be? So it's a yellow t shirt with black writing. Ooh. This is gonna be interesting. Who is it gonna be? We haven't had a Rey Mysterio thing in here yet. Oh, okay. It's the late great Jimmy Superfly Snooker. I wasn't expecting that. So yeah, we have Jimmy the Superfly Snooker, and it's a yellow T-shirt with like the mad like tribally looking tiger stripes through it. Pretty cool. I don't know if I'd wear. I don't know if I would wear a yellow T-shirt around. <laughs> Um, it's a bit bright, but I don't know, I might wear it every now and then, but like, you know, rest in peace, Snooker, recently died, you know, if you don't already know. Okay guys, so that's everything in this month's Pro Wrestling Crate. Um, here's the spoilers right here, so, of course, if you got the one month one, you would have got the Macho Man Randy Savage t-shirt. If you got the tag team plan, you would have gotten the Temple of God Matt Seidel t-shirt, and it is Evan Bourne, because it's the photo, so I, I definitely know that. I wasn't really, not, I kind of know he's Matt Seidel, but I was like, I don't know, like, I kind of hope you don't roast me if it's not. <laughs> but it is, it's Evan Bourne from WWE, Matt Seidel. Um, so you would have got Macho Man and Matt Seidel's t-shirt, which is the Temple of God, if you got the two month one, if you got the tag team plan. And then the triple threat plan, you would have got the Superfly, Jimmy Snooker t-shirt, as well as the Matt Seidel and Macho Man one. And then just to recap, you know, you got the Hardys, uh, Vanguard 1 Beta Prototype Model Frisbee, awesome as hell, definitely happy about that. We have This Is Awesome Lazy Fans Clapper, so if you don't want to clap, you know, you just tch, 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 tch. <laughs> And then you have the RVD uh, autographed 8x10. We have the Cruiserweight Mustafa Ali Best of Freelance DVD. Ricochet vs Will Ospreay BOSJ uh, 2016 poster. We have the um, Hardy Boys logo, so I was right, I didn't, you know, I wasn't sure if it was just Jeff or Matt, but it's both Hardy Boys, so I was 100% right there. So Hardy Boys logo as the pin. Uh, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat commemorative pendant, which is that little triangle thing. And then the ECW Arena postcard of Psychosis vs. Rey Mysterio Jr. autograph by Psychosis. So I was wondering who signed it, Psychosis did. That's pretty cool. So guys, that was February's Pro Wrestling Crate. High Flyers was the theme. Pretty awesome. Everything in that I loved so much. It was probably the best one that they've done to date. Like they said, best one to date. Um, Latino Heat, which is last month's one, will be in the description down below, guys. And also, if you want to check out the one before that, which was December, I believe the theme was Stables. All these three crates that I have unboxed so far have amazed me. Like, this crate is by far the crate I look forward to the most. Every single month, I'm like, I can't wait for that pro wrestling crate to come. When it comes, I'm gonna be so happy. I'm gonna be so happy in this house. But guys, definitely hit that like button hard if you did enjoy this one, but not too hard. Don't break your computers. If you wanna follow me on Instagram and Twitter, the links in the description down below. If you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button to join the dots ones for the road of the G Star to everybody you know. Make sure you definitely hit that little bell while you also subscribe, guys. So you can be notified every time I upload a video. And not only will you be a part of the Dog Squad, but you'll be a part of the Notification Dog Squad. Guys, hopefully you did enjoy this one like I did. Like I said, this one amazes me every single month. It's always the one that I look forward to the most out of all the subscription boxes. Like Slam Crate, I do enjoy that a lot too. Which is by Loot Crate. This is like all WWE stuff. However, that comes every second month. So that's the downside about that. Whereas this one comes every damn month. 
and I'm pretty damn happy. High flies. I'll be wearing all these t-shirts. I don't know about the snooker one because it's really bright yellow, but the other two I'll wear with pride. Well, of course the snooker one I'll wear with pride too, but maybe not as much around downtown. But guys, hopefully you did enjoy this. But guys, hopefully you did enjoy this. Make sure you check out all my other recent videos, like check out last month's Pro Wrestling Crate. Check out the Loot Crate for February. It was theme was Build. Check out my WWE Ushis and NRL Trader Cards. All their links will be in the description down below, guys. And as always, stay awesome. The Jace Dog is out of here. See ya.